What up guys, it's Nelson with Galaxy Note 2 Soft Modder, and today I'm going to be showing you how to install Cyanogen Mod's Apollo Music Player. Um, Cyanogen Mod has a bunch of great features. We've already uh, brought you a few of the features like their stock text messaging app and their uh, stock clock widget app. So today I'm going to be showing you their music player. Um, the first thing you'll want to do is head over and download it. Um, it's titled Apollo APK. If you guys also want to install the Hollow Light theme, you can you can download that. So uh, and that'll make it uh, the Apollo the stock one. You'll have the ability to change to a, a lighter toned color for the for the application. So I'm gonna download it. It'll be quick. It's a third party application, so you'll need to have unknown sources checked. And I'll just open it up, verify and install and I'm replacing the application. This application actually used to be on the Play Store, but it got banned. So now you have to download it like this. So I'll just install it. And now I'll open it up. Uh, what's different about this stock player is that it finds um, your artist information is uh, automatically without you having to do anything. So I have a lot of songs that and I didn't have uh, the artist, um, the album, t or I mean any pictures for them. So they just came out like blank. And as soon as I opened this, I could already see pictures for all of the songs that I had downloaded, which is pretty awesome. I mean, you don't, uh, I didn't have to do anything and it just came up. So here's, for Danny Brown, I didn't have anything for Boards of Canada, for Jay-Z. It's funny because for this song, Jay-Z featuring Beyonce, it shows both of them in the pictures. So it's that detailed. And here's Jay-Z featuring Timberlake. Justin Timberlake, and both of them are in the picture, Jay-Z featuring Frank Ocean, they're both in the picture. So all that is pretty awesome. Uh, from there, you can just swipe over, um, you can see the albums, and, and then it'll be the songs. Um, you can go to settings, and that was the light, the hollow light. The, the uh, From theme chooser, you can choose. I'll show you guys, the, that's the uh, the darker one. So we'll just go back, and you have to kind of wait. It'll change eventually. Um, you can also go to settings, and what else can you do? You can actually change the default color scheme and just mess with it. You know, do whatever you want, which is also pretty awesome. Um, you can here. It's here's a download missing album art automatically, uh, missing artist images, and uh, if you want to do it only with Wi-Fi, um, you can also. Whoa, let's get out of here. You can also have uh, widgets. And here are two of the widgets. There's a bigger one, which is a four. Um, takes about like that much of the space. And you guys can use it. And I'll just, just pause it. And it works, yeah. I like it more than the stock one because of the ability to uh, automatically find album art. I think that's really important. That way it doesn't make uh, all my songs look just kind of, you know, just kind of shitty. Oh, let's go back and, uh, whoops, I'll show you guys the, what it looks like when it's hollow dark. And this is the hollow dark, it's black, it's completely black. So I, I prefer this one, no, actually I prefer the hollow light, but I mean they're both cool, I guess it just depends on how you're feeling, the mood and everything. But yeah, it's about, you can also search here, just like any other application, and, uh, and yeah, that's it. Alright, thanks guys. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and check out the full tutorial over at Galaxy Note 2 Software. Alright, thanks.